Hello, everybody. My name is Queen Chen. Previously, I talked about configuration and Hydra. The configuration allows you to keep all of your parameters in one place and separate them from the .py file. Hydra allows you to assess these parameters easily. For example, to assess the values in a configuration file through my .py file, I just need to use the decorator Hydra document. Then to assess a certain values in the parameters, for example, the value under process keep columns, we can use a doc notation which is config doc process doc keep columns. In this video, I'm going to talk about all the useful features of Hydra, such as create variations of the same parameters, set default parameters, and override parameters on the command line. A lot of time you might want to change the parameters inside a configuration file to see which combination of parameters result in the best metrics. For example, if you think the column response might not contribute too much in predicting how much a customer will buy a product, you might want to eliminate this column and then run the entire pipeline and see if you got a better result with the change in the number of features. So ideally, you want to keep the record of the parameters that you have experimented with so that if you like a certain result, you can go back to the parameters that is responsible for that result. So how can you do that with Hydra? You can see that I create multiple versions of the parameters to process the data. So in process one, I have keep columns, remove earlier threshold and family size. In process 2, I have different combination of keep columns. In process 3, I have another combination of keep columns. Now, I just need to specify the default process file that I want to use. And here, I choose the file process 2. Now, let's try to print the configuration file and see how it looks like. First, let's go to Hydra group. Then we run the print config file. So you can see all the parameters that is inside the file process too is combined with all the parameters in the main.yam file. So this is very convenient because not only that you are able to keep the record of different combination of parameters, but you can also change the process file that you want to use from the command line. So for example, if I want to experiment with the parameters in process one doc yam i can just run process source print config doc py and then i specify the process to be process one and you can see these parameters look exactly the same as the parameters that we see in process one doc yam so to recap with hydra ability to create multiple version of specific parameters we can keep the record of all of the parameters that we want to experiment with we are also able to set a default file to use if you want to change the default file to another configuration file we can just override the default file on the command line this project can be assessed via my repository hydra demo you can find how to clone install and set up the environment here